construct an involute of a circle of, on a circle of diameter 40. Then the radius of our circle is what? Radius 20. So I'm picking my radius 20 millimeters. All right. This is radius 20 mm. Then placing it at this midpoint. And what? Producing my circle. After producing my circle, I'm going to divide the circle into what? Into eight equal halves. So I can make use of my angle 45 degrees set square to do that. So kindly do that also. And I'm going to denote it 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 0 over 8. After doing that, the next thing is to uh, on point number 3, I'm going to draw the tangent on point number 3 in this way. I'm going to strike the divisor and it tries three times. One, two, and what? And three. All right, that's it. On point number four, it's going to be this way. And I'm going to draw the tangent of point number four. And I'm going to strike. And up on it four times one, two, three, and four. All right, so this is the point on point number four here. That was the point on point number four here. For point number five, I'm drawing the tangent on point number five here, and I'm stepping it up on it how many times? Five times. One, two, three, four, and five. All right, so this is it. Five times. On number six, I am drawing the tangent on point number six. Okay, then I'm stepping it off how many times? Six times. Six times. One, two, point six. So this is the end point here. So for point seven, this is the tangent for point seven. And point seven, this is the tangent. Then I'm stepping it off how many times? Seven times with the divisor. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven. All right. So that's the point. So on point eight, this is the line. All right. So eight times one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. All right. So this is the number either. So the next thing is pick your French curve or your uh, flexible curve, then join the point starting from point zero here. Join the point which you asterisk, right? Join them together to give you your, the involute of a circle. All right, so that is uh, the curve. So this is an involute of a circle. Thank you.